favorite character? I guess, could you have played another one? Of course he is. One? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah? Yeah, yeah. I, um, absolutely he's my favorite character, you know, especially because I get to spend the most time with him, you know, and, and, and basically coming up with a way of representing him. Uh, but yeah, yeah, I... I uh, I really like I really like being the guy who who basically has to have an armor that isn't, you know, leather mail and weapons. He's the guy at the back who's basically trying to digest this this big supernatural dumbfounding world through through you know the guises of humor and and trying to just trying to digest the whole thing in a very normal way. And uh, it's it's nice it's fun being the normal eyes on a very abnormal world. Do you know what I mean? And hopefully you can. You can juice a lot of comedy from that position. <laughs> from Mission Viejo, Yasmin. Oh, yeah. Right there. Since 2.30. What, since 2... Come here, give her this bag. Give her this bag. Can you pass this bag? It's kind of a heavy bag, look at it. Since 2... Give her that bag of stuff. I have no idea what's that. It's reserve. <laughs> Robert Yasmin with the bag of stuff there that... She's crying. I love you. Look at her. Oh, yes, me. Hey, can somebody... It's nice, because uh, there's a t-shirt in the bag, and she's using it now as a... <laughs> hey, can somebody do me a favor? Handkerchief. Can somebody do me a favor? Can you get Yasmin and bring her to the stage over here? Let's go right here. Bring Yasmin to the stage. Oh, my God! I'm sorry, I can't do this for everyone, but just... Hey, I'm hosting this damn thing. Let's do it. Where's Yasmin now? Where is she? Yasmin! Hold on, you guys. Bring me Yasmin. I will not wrap this interview until I talk to Yasmin on stage. Where's she at? I think she's, I think she's lost. a shadow hunter. No, don't go into Tiffany's. Come to the stage. Okay. Yasmin, can you hug him? Some badass runes, Yasmin. Look, take, look, take this chair here. Here you go. I'm not sitting in this. Here you go. Yasmin. Take a load off. You gonna take that? Sorry. Picture my butt there. There you go. Yasmin, are you okay? I'm gonna die. That's not good. All right, Robert. Yasmin. Well, actually, you know what? As opposed to me asking the question. Let's just have you ask the question. I forgot it. <laughs> Did you ever expect to get this much attention from this fandom when taking on the role of Simon? Yep. Oh, God. Okay. Did you ever expect to get this much attention in this fandom while taking on the role of Simon? Nice. Good, good interview technique there, yes, man. Good work, good work. Greenhouse, greenhouse, supply. <laughs> I, I, absolutely not. I mean... It, it, there's, there's absolutely no way of, of, of knowing, you know, just how, just how kind of feverish the fandom will be. But I think the first, the first time I realized it was when we were in Comic-Con. That was the first time I realized just the, 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 the fanatic, the feverishness of the fans of, the, of, the, of this series of books. That's when I got it, like, directly, because I'm, I'm quite, uh, uh, I, I'm, ki I'm fairly lazy when it comes to the whole social networking. So, so, you know, I'm, I'm quite not present on the Twitters and the Facebooks. So, uh, Comic-Con Comic was very much the first time, and it's like, absolutely mind-blowing. This is mind-blowing! I feel like... I feel like we're the Rolling Stones here. Yeah! I think Robert, so you... far you've had the we're... longest answer. What's that? You've had, like, the longest answer so far. <laughs> Good! There you go. Robert, are you, are you not on Twitter? Are you maybe. not on Twitter at all? I am now, yeah. I have a, I have a Twitter site, which I, I'm very lax, lackadaisical in checking it. But uh, do I do well, check it from time Twitter to time. He said, that do see messages. Yeah. Yeah. You need to get this guy on Twitter a little more. You, you, you'll have so many followers in one day. Yeah. Are you guys all following him, or do you know his Twitter? Yeah. Well, follow him? No, no. I appreciate the love, but I, I find it all very baffling. Someday someone will educate me. And show Jamie. me how to use it. Oh, sorry. Jimmy, question from question from Becca in Van Nuys. Hi Becca, right sorry, I fly just flew into my eye. What's, 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 what's the question? You all right? You good? Yeah, no, we're good now. We're good. 
Happy birthday, dear. Happy, Happy birthday, Milan. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. Is that the question? That is not the question. We'll answer the question. Well, it says, then we'll... have you recorded any songs for the movie? Perhaps happy birthday. Right? No, I ha haven't I haven't recorded any songs for the movie. Um, you know, would I like to be on the soundtrack for movie too? Absolutely. You know, it's not down to me though. Um, you know, there's some songs floating about at the moment you guys can find on the internet and stuff. So they're out there. And uh, you'd like us to sing happy birthday? Oh Lord, she's gonna cry. Here we go. I, no, all of us are singing. I'm not singing this alone. We're all singing it together. Maybe we'll do maybe a, you know. No deal, no dice. No dice. Do it. Ready? We'll all sing. Is this gonna do it with me? One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Becca, just sing it. Happy birthday to Becca. Happy birthday to you. Hey, uh, Jamie, another question. This one from Mel. Mel says, oh, "Is Mel? Hi, Mel." Mel! From Hesperi, Hesperi, Hesperi. You gotta work on this handwriting there, Mel. My goodness. I love you, Mel. Sorry. How does it feel to be cast in one of the uh, three biggest movie series of our generation? Harry Potter, Twilight, Mortal Instruments. How does that feel? It uh, it feels mental. Um, to be honest with you. Terrifying. Uh, you know, I, I wanted to be in the first Twilight, um, and, uh, you know, that didn't come about, so when I was asked if I wanted to be in the second one, and subsequently the last two, I was like, absolutely. Um, and then with Potter, you know, it's an English, sort of, it's an English institution, I suppose, British institution, rather, and, um, and so when they, uh, like, called me up and were like, do you want to play a small part? And that was like, of course, I'll do anything, you, I'll do anything, you know. I'll jump out a window, and that's actually what I had to do. Uh, but by Christ, was that the best jumping out the window that anybody's ever seen. It was. I'm surprised they didn't get Best Supporting Actor uh, at the Oscars for that. Um, and, and now this, you know, uh, uh, for me, you know, it, it, I'm, I, the fact that somebody wants to pay me money, you know, to dress up in funny clothes and say lines and do what it is that I love is still absolutely dumbfounding. Um, but, uh, you know, very blessed and honoured and grateful. Lily! This question is from uh, Emmy in uh, Irvine. Emmy, are you here? Make eye contact with Lily. Make eye contact. Who is it? Everyone's staring at me. <laughs> I'm not sure which one. Okay. Emmy's... Oh, your sister. Okay. Right there. Oh, Where? I see you. Okay. Over oh, there. in the Hi. green. That's you. She's all decked out in her runes. Oh, happy birthday for tomorrow. Sorry, we can't sing happy birthday again. Uh, but happy birthday. Hey, uh, Lily, uh, Emmy says, if you could play a different role in the movie, who would you want to be? P.S. I love you. You're my favorite. Awesome actress, she says. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yes, actually, um, I'd love to play Magnus. <laughs> yeah, not just because Kevin Zegers. Um, <laughs> no, I wa I'd want to play uh, Magnus because um, he... <laughs> He has awesome makeup, he throws the coolest parties, yet at the same time, he's wise beyond his years, he's like hundreds and hundreds of years old, and he's really good to have around in times of crisis. So he's good to throw the party and good at the end of the night when you need help going home. Greenhouse! Greenhouse, Greenhouse exactly, thank you, sir. <laughs> Where's Jane, uh, Jane from Forestville, where's Jane at? She left. Right there, is that you, Jane? Jane has a question for you, Lily. She says, when you were in high school, what were your favorite fiction books for recreational reading? Ooh, um... That long ago. <laughs> this is the fake one! I know that. She, knows, she just tells me what books meant. She's like, books? What is, what's that um, reading? Strangely enough, Harry Potter. I have to say, I wanted to be Hermione so bad. <laughs> But it's, but it's okay because now I'm Clary, which is way better. She does a great impression of Hermione, actually. No, it's really you know, It's good, it is good. It is really heavy. <laughs> yeah, 
no, Harry Potter all the way. I think I read the last three books in like two weeks. My mom will attest I didn't leave the house. I was obsessed, but I'm more obsessed with mortal instruments. So. We could have been, we could have been killed. We could have been killed together. Or worse, expelled. Or worse, expelled. <laughs> really, try to get your priorities straight, Harry. Oh. As we wrap this up, uh, Lily, final thoughts of the movie. What should the fans know? Any any final notes, or should I just end this and say Greenhouse? Uh, oh, you could say Greenhouse all day long. No, um, honestly, I think I speak for all of us up here when we say that we're so incredibly proud of the movie that we created. Um, we wanted to honor and, of course, pay complete tribute to Cassie's writing. We kept the comedy in there. There's obviously the romance, there's drama, but there is such amazing action. Like, for the guys out there, if you think this is just a chick flick, you're so wrong. Because the action in this movie is amazing. Um, and yeah, I, I don't know. I think we're just, we're so honored to be here and meet you guys face to face. And I really hope you enjoy the movie. Go opening weekend five times. <laughs> You, I hope you enjoy it, but honestly, I, I, I love you all. We all love you, and you're the reason that these books are what they are and that we get to be up here, so thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.